Hello, Charlie Cricket here, and welcome back to Kids Bench. Today we're going to be going over Grasshopper. Grasshopper is one of my second favorite subjects to talk about. Most of the time crickets get confused with grasshoppers, but the truth is crickets we're a lot smaller than grasshoppers, and one of the biggest differences is grasshoppers, they don't like come out at night. They get cold really easy, so they need the sun to keep nice and warm. With crickets, now we like it to be at night. That's why, like, when you go camping, you hear us playing all night, da da da, da having a good time, and you make it so you can't sleep. The only difference is sometimes I got I got to get up early to go fishing, so I can't stay up all night. But so the other crickets make fun of me because they don't like the fish because they're scared of fish because fishy crickets. Ooh. Okay, but let's go back to this. And they also crickets have long antennas go all the way like the length of their body. Now I keep mine short for the videos. Otherwise, they tend to be getting all over the place and stuff like that. But most of the time, grasshoppers, they, they have short antennas. Okay, but well, let's get back on the subject again. So today, we're going we're gonna to learn about grasshoppers. We're going to draw grasshoppers. We might even get some time to play a game, maybe some music. Okay, and uh, this button right here is the fast forward button. This is the fun one when like like George is tired and stuff, or we're drawing a video when we go fast. We hit this button. Blah, 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 and, sorry, we hit that button and everything goes really fast. Okay, and now... Now, also, too, a lot of people think grasshoppers just jump. Well, no. Grasshoppers can fly, too. What they do is they jump first, and then they fly. Can you jump? And then what you got to do is, is jump up, jump, and then flap your wings. They jump, flap the wings. And then, they, you know, and they even in the, and just like the mayfly, if you watch the mayfly, these guys have been around since the dinosaurs. Yeah, they've been around for a long time. Oh, arm getting stuck behind my back. Hold on. Oh, there we go. Sometimes get caught in the vest. Okay, so let's let's start with the drawing. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna draw we're gonna draw a realistic one. So he's gonna go kind of quick, but listen, if if, if you don't want to draw and you just want to color and play the games and you want to color the the drawings that we're doing on here, that's easy enough. You just gotta have mommy or daddy or someone go to funwithflies.com, go to the kids bench and you'll see a link where it says kids bench workbooks. You click on the workbook and you click on the grasshopper and you can download the pictures to a PDF so they can print it off. And then you could color it with your crayons. But I still want you to try drawing them too, because drawing them is kind of fun. Okay, so still try drawing them, but if you want to if you want to save some pictures and you want to color some pictures, what we did is we had our artist do, do some pictures for you so you could just color them and have fun. Okay, so let's go, let's do the drawing part now. So we're gonna click on the drawing, and then if you look down here, you can see George, he, he's gonna start drawing, he's gonna start drawing a grasshopper. Now, he's not going to go that fast, but he's going to go quick. We're going to go slower on the other one. But uh, while he's drawing the grasshopper, you see, see he's already drawing the head. He's drawing, he's drawing the body. And it's fun to watch him do that. Now, now so you got your piece of paper, and you're drawing too, so you want to draw the head, the body. And if you have to, you tell mommy or daddy or someone to, to pause everything. So when you pause everything... Oh, sorry, <laughs> I didn't mean to pause me, but, but, but pause and stop everything right there. So, so you could take your time and draw it too. It's fun. I love to draw too. I love to draw, but I can't draw right now because I got to do, I got to, I got to work right now. I work it well. It's not work. It's more like fun, fun, learning about the grasshoppers. So while you're drawing the grasshopper, make sure you draw yeah, you gotta draw that body. You gotta draw them legs. You got legs just like just like me. You got a couple of legs, got wings, just like me. Did you know while you're drawing some people like to eat grasshoppers? Yeah. I never heard about anybody eating crickets. We eat crick, uh, grasshoppers. They cover them with chocolate and stuff like that. But I've never had one. Have you ever eaten a chocolate covered grasshopper? And if you did, was it good? Have you ever had a chocolate cover cricket? I hope not. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Okay, he's moving right along. Looks like we're almost about halfway there. And I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna do is we're gonna tell him, hey Joy, when, when you're done. Okay, can, can, can you color this one, and, and then we're gonna make a diagram so we can we can see what the parts of a grasshopper are. We 
We draw in the grasshopper. We draw in the grasshopper. Well, we're almost getting there. Now, I think when we when we draw the other, when we, we're going to draw another grasshopper too. We're going to draw one that's more like me, like a cartoon one that's fun to draw. But we'll put a little music out in the background so you can listen to some music while, while you're drawing that one. Because we're, we're going to do that one nice and slow. Because sometimes, so you got to understand crickets. We, we do everything really fast. We're, we are all over the place. We, you ever try and catch a cricket? We hop, we jump, we run, trying to slow down. So sometimes I go too fast. So people got to say, hey, you know, hey, cricket, slow down. Oh, look, he's almost done. So he's almost done. So when he's done, we're going to have him, we're going to have him color that cricket. Can you spell grasshopper? Yeah, can you spell grasshopper? Ready? G R A S S H O P P E R. Grasshopper. All right, there we go. All right, he he made a color. And now, now yeah, you put the put the diagrams on there. Okay, so we got a grasshopper right down here. So if you look, the first thing we're going to say is the grasshopper has a head. So everybody say grasshopper point to the head. That's the head. Okay. Now his body is called a thorax. So say thorax. Thorax. That's his body. That's like his chest. That's that's his chest and his is where where like his heart is. You know you know where your chest is, right? Right, your chest is like under your neck. It's where you would put your t-shirt. You need a chest that holds your t-shirt up. Okay, like mine, my chest, my chest. If I didn't have a chest, my, my fly fishing vest would fall on the ground. Okay, and then next to that is the abdomen. So everybody say abdomen. So where's the thorax? Yep, that's the thorax. Where's the head? Oh, where's the head? And where, where's the abdomen? Okay, cool. Okay, so the next one we're going to do is I'm going to let you guys draw your own cricket. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna put them big on the screen, and then we'll play a little music, and I'll come back when we're done, and then and then you get a little bit of time, and you can color it, and I'll put him up on the screen so so you can draw him right along with George. Now you could he he said he's gonna show us a little something different. He he's gonna sketch it, and and then he's gonna show you how he makes a cartoon with it, which is actually kind of cool because he sketches it. So sketching means you don't have to draw it real nice and draw it perfect, and then he goes over it and he traces it. And that's how he makes a cartoon. So we're going to let him do that. And we're going to come back and we're going to play some games.
Boy, that's fun. I just love drawing. But I promise you, I said when we get back, we'll play a game. So let's play a game and see what we learned so far. Okay, can you tell which one is a grasshopper? Okay, so we got two bugs right here. It's important you learn the difference, okay? Because we don't want you to mistake. When you come up to me, you're going to say, hey, Charlie Cricket, not hey, Charlie Grasshopper. Okay, ready? Let's start with, uh, let's see. They're both bugs, okay? Uh, we both have big legs in the back so we can jump and hop. Uh, we both got wings, and we can't tell if it's daytime or night. So what was it that told us apart? Now, I, I, uh, I know what it is. One of us has really, really long antenna, and one of us has only short antenna. Now, I know my mine look kind of short, but they're folded back. Mine are actually really long. I got to tie it back when I'm making videos. Otherwise, they get all over the place. So I guess a cricket is this one. Did you say this one's a cricket? Because if you did, that was a good job. Okay, let me want to try it again. Let me bring up another one. Okay, so here we go. Let's try a different one. Okay, so let's see. They're both bugs. They both got long legs. And we both got wings. Hmm, oh, that's right. One of them's got long antenna, the other one's got short antenna. So you're right if you say, this one's a grasshopper, and this one is the cricket. All right, you're getting good at this. So now for the hard part. Now we're going to put a bunch of grasshoppers on a page, and we're going to see how many are there. So you can see if you can tell them apart really quick, because when you see one, there's usually a bunch of them. How many grasshoppers? So... Why don't you go ahead and you try and count how many, and I'm going to count two, but I'm not going to say it out loud. Oh, wait a minute. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, you got to make sure because we got to double check because we don't want to confuse crickets with grasshoppers. So if we take a look at them again, uh-huh, that one, what is he? Can anybody guess what he is? I give you a hint. Ah, it's me, it's me, it's me. Wait, it's me, it's me. Did you say cricket? Yeah, 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 you're right, okay. And look at that, look, it looks like there's another cricket. Can you point to where the other cricket is? Ah, uh, you gotta look around. Is that, oh, I see, I see, you pointing at him right there. There's a look, and how are you able to tell? You have to tell because of them long antennas, right? You know, so why don't we count again? So, so how many grasshoppers are there? Let's see, there's one, two, you like how my arms stretch? Can you stretch your arms? Watch this one, I can stretch. Another one I can stretch too, watch this one. Whoa, <laughs> that's so crickets can stretch their arms up really long. Oh, I'm sorry, I got sidetracked, hold on. One, Oh, not cricket. One grasshopper. Two grasshoppers. Three grasshoppers. Four grasshoppers. Five grasshoppers. We got six grasshoppers. Now this looks fun. I love counting stuff. This is so much fun. Okay, well let's let's go back. Well, I want to thank you all for 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 watching the video and learning about grasshoppers with me. I'm sure it was exciting. And, and we'll see about making another one. I think next maybe we'll do spiders. Ooh, I like spiders. Uh, but why don't we do this? Why don't we end the video? And we'll go over to George and we'll we'll have him tie one of them one of, one, of, one of the grasshoppers really fast so we can watch it. And we'll put some music, okay? And while while he's tying that, you could practice the grasshopper dance. And the grasshopper dance is you gotta you gotta jump up, fly around, hop around, jump up, fly around, hop around. Okay, well. Have fun. We'll see you on the next video. And it's going to be George. He's going to be tying himself another cricket. And we'll see you soon. This is Charlie Cricket. This is your fishing buddy telling you bye-bye.
Hello, Charlie Cricket here. I want to tell you a little bit about FunWithFlies.com. First off, I hope you're enjoying the video. I like watching George Tyler and Flies. Uh, if you visit the website, FunWithFlies.com, you'll notice that all the patterns are on there, so that they're all free to watch. There's nothing to sign up. That includes videos on different kinds of techniques. You can have basic videos for the beginner who wants to learn, start with the basics and wants to learn some of the basics or some easier flies to tie. My favorite's Kids Bench. I teach Kids Bench. That's for the little guys and girls, and they can go in and they can uh, learn how to draw the bugs. They learn about the bugs. They can play games. You even got uh, you can download pictures to color. Uh, it's just all around a lot of fun. And of course, there's YouTube. So make sure you subscribe to that so you can see all the updates. Okay, well I look forward to seeing you. This is Charlie Cricket. You have a good day. Bye.